Hello and welcome to Charger Games. This is Raja and in this video we're gonna learn how we can repeatedly call a specific function again and again and again. So as you have said, as you have seen in the last video that we have used the instantiate function but we were unable, we were unable to call it again and again and again uh, a specific time without using the update function and using it in the update function is a bad option. So in, in order to recover that, we will use another specific, another special function which helps us to call some other functions repeatedly again and again and again. So if we can call the instantiate, uh, if we can call this instantiate after a limited amount of time, then we can generate the ball after a limited amount of time and after a limited amount of time, new ball will get uh, generated and it will come down a new ball will get generated and it will go down so this is how we'll create a create a cool flow or something cool okay so some we'll create something which we were not able to achieve in the last video so in this video we're gonna actually learn how to repeatedly call something in a good way so first of all let me create a simple function and inside that inst and inside that let me put the code of the instantiate so let me do control x and control v so now this inst, inst function helps to instantiate the ball so now all you have to do is by some mechanism we have to repeatedly call this inst function so one function that helps us to repeatedly call another function is called invoke repeat so if we write invoke repeating now as you can see we have first of all we have a string parameter which uh, in which we will give the name of the function that we wanna call so here we wanna repeatedly call this inst function so within string within quotes we will write inst or inst then we have to write the time after which we wanna call this function Suppose we want to call this function after uh, maybe one second. So we write 1f since it's a float. And we want to just close it. Now, if I go here, as you can see, it says uh, no method takes two arguments. So we have to put three arguments here. So as the third argument, I just put 1f. So the repeat rate is 1. So after one second, it will be called one time. So with that being done, since this is attached to this, so after one second, this invoke repeating will call this function after one second, one time. So it will call it one, one after one second, once. So if I go ahead and run it right now, now as you can see, we have something cool. After one second, a new ball is getting generated, our name ball is getting instantiated, and we have made something cool. So this is the very first time we have made something that is automatically happening in the game, and we have written the code for that. So this is a very, very cool function that you can use in a lot of places. So I hope you guys will make something cool with it. So thank you guys for watching, and we'll learn about more of this cool stuff in the next videos so see you in the next video thanks for watching